I would go to the next shade over. I guess this is another way to say this. In mainstream media, Native Americans represent less than one half percent of all media. In, in my opinion, we have our own versions of uh, Tupac's biggies, you know what I mean? We have our own Picassos, you know, and nobody really hears about that. Wow. But it, it can get really thin. Right. And then same thing. Yeah. We should be on the track. <laughs> You're paying the whole thing. <laughs> it's freaking cool. I know, right? I love it. I thought, I thought she was single-handedly going to paint this. <laughs> yeah. I was having them paint with uh, the smaller caps too, so they would take more time. And they still got it done? <laughs> <laughs> So I wanted to team up with Cats of Flagstaff because um, I really identify with their mission and their vision. Um, I personally have a brother, he's been on the streets now for about seven years and um, I, it's, this is my way of like giving back to the community, giving back to um, people like my brother that, that just need a helping hand. And it's something small as a, as a shower or as a, as a pair of socks or um, you know, a couple kind words. It would really go a really long way, you know. I do think that I was a good fit for the, for the whole project because um, when I was younger, I struggled with addiction. I struggled with a lot of the same things that, um, not, not just myself or my brother, but a lot of Native Americans in general um, have to go through. And, and I, I can relate. I can really relate to a lot of the people that they're going to be helping, so. Yes, sir. The project was pretty good. A lot of good medicine, good energy, good vibes, good weather, blessed by the rain. Gave us a break every now and then. All in all, the project came together. It was good. I enjoyed it. And thank you all for having us. And invest in yourself. <laughs> <laughs>